Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to this video on Windows 10 doing this complete system black screen. Now I wanted to kind of get a little bit in depth with the issue that I'm experiencing to see if it may relate to the issue that you're also experiencing. Of such, uh, whenever I'm playing a game on my gaming rig, um, you know, it could be 30 minutes or an hour in the game uh, that my computer screens just go completely black. My keyboard and mouse becomes non-responsive, but yet the computer is still running. So sometimes I can hear some audio of the game, and then sometimes not. But majority of the times, it's just, you know, the complete system goes into this blackout where I have to do a power cycle to bring the system back online. Now, after I do the power cycle, the issue does repeat itself. So, you know, I've, I've, I've went into the typical, you know, you go to ensure that your Windows 10 device updates are, you know, the latest and greatest is installed. I've done that. And as you can see, you know, last check today. I've also done, you know, updating my graphics card, of which, uh, you know, I made sure that I have the latest and greatest uh, video driver yes after doing that did a power cycle of my PC and still complete blackout so before we kind of get into exactly the steps that I took to resolve the issue at this very moment okay because I've been, I've been at, since I've did this you know this fix I've been playing roughly two days and no issues now knock on wood okay so before we even get to what I the steps that I took, uh, what I want to do is show you guys the game, Call of Duty game that I was playing so you guys can visually see what happened. Um, now I do warn you, you know, me and the guy, man, we, 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 we were in the zone, man. We were in the zone. So, you know, the language, you know, it, it may not be suited for kids. But uh, yeah, let's play that clip, baby. Alright, whoa. Oh, yeah, I'm, looking at, I'm looking at his ass. Okay. I didn't know I was fucking looking at him. What, 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 what was he? Because it looks like you got shot from behind, though. No, he's right in front of me. Oh, shit. Got him. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. Oh, shit. This gun I have is garbage, but. I only got like 10 shots. Crazy. Where's he at? Right here. Oh, he behind that rock. Yep. I broke his arm right down up here. Let me assassinate him so I can get this assassination safe. Good stuff. That was easy. Alright, where to? Um. Uh, I guess here. Alright. Oh, look, there's a car right here. Watch your back, watch your back, watch your back. Ah, shit, he's right in front of me. Where is he? Oh, shit. That's why I don't like that gun. I'm changing my class right now. Yeah. I didn't have no Ah, why? Alright, we're going to restart it. And what we're going to do is... So we're gonna uninstall the MSI video software and also we're gonna see if we can manually remove it from device manager. So as the computer boots up, we want to completely remove this software. Alright. So what we're gonna do is go to programs and Let's see if I can find out. Here it goes AMD software. We're gonna completely remove it. 20.12.1 is installed. It's almost five o'clock in the morning, so my mind is like, yeah, not really here. But man, oh man. That was quick, man. I, I, I just got into the game and it just completely just 
black screen on me. Oh my god. We need to also do a restart. I'm just going to check uh, device manager. I want to see exactly what's on here under display. AMD. So I'm going to do an uninstall. So that was the manual uninstall of the display driver. Make sure you have the latest and greatest Windows updates, which I do. But, you know, there may be more. There may be more. Uh, but I do. I do have it. Um, let's just go ahead and restart. Knock this out. Sometimes I have this weird display, like glitch, um, where if I open up, um, I go to YouTube and I open up the video and I maximize it, it just, the screen will go, what do they call it, what do they call it? artifacts. I'll see artifacts in my uh, display. Let's go to device manager and just see if, uh, if it re... Here we go, display. Okay, so Microsoft Basic Display Adapter. All right, cool. Now let's go to Task Manager and see what displays there. All right, so it doesn't display AMD. All right, cool. When I maximize my screen, I get this crazy, crazy uh, artifact. So what I want to do is I want to play this. Man, I'm going to go full screen. Look at that. I'm not getting any artifacts. Like, this whole thing will just go green. And full screen again. No artifacts. And full screen again. Yeah, I might get any artifacts. My screen's not turning green and yellow. I don't know. Alright, well, let's try a different video. Uh-oh. Oh. That was Windows behind the scene. All right, guys. So that quick flash was Windows installing a driver for the MSI card that I have here, or you can call it AMD card that I have here, which is the R9390. And I know that by going to Tax Manager Performance, and if I scroll down, I see the GPU here, AMD R9390. Okay, and it displays, you know. 8 gigs all right so since we uninstalled all of the drivers uh, even though Windows quote unquote found a driver for our graphics card we still do not have the drivers for our HDMI uh, audio and without this without these drivers we're not going to be able to output the sound to our video PC what I need to do is I need to now go online, download the drivers, and rock on from there. So that's what we're going to do. Since I have a uh, R9 390, I went to AMD's website, uh, did a search of the cart, and I'm at the point where we can select the driver. So I have Windows 10 64-bit, so we're just going to click download. But one thing for sure, guys, you know, seeing that, you know, when I played a YouTube video, maximize that, and now, so yeah, it's, I'm not seeing any artifacts, video artifacts, which I was getting before. This is showing me a sign that potentially it may have been a driver issue. All right, so now, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to open and install give that some time yes this is installing installing here leave at that default location so we're gonna let it install then we'll proceed after that factory set will remove all prior versions yep that's what we want to do remove everything and temporary pause one of those updates on your system can do a complete factory reset as you can see right now AMD has removed the driver that Windows 10 had installed 
and now it's requested for a restart so we're going to restart the computer All right so now i'm gonna log back in it should resume by itself so we'll give it some time give it some time all right so now it's it's installing i'm just going to chill and just watch chill and watch that's what i'm doing all right so now it's requesting for let me just remove that a restart so we're going to restart again it's nothing like a restart you know what let me look at this resolution all right you know let's do 1680 i'm gonna do both of them at 1680. keep that looking at my computer it's it's cut off i have like these extended monitors go back to youtube i want to see if it's a resolution so I know we we'll just we we'll just keep keep this. We got it muted. So, all right, we're gonna exit full screen and open full screen. Look at that. Exit full screen and then open full screen. Exit ex full screen and then open full screen. Well, I'll be done. So, our issue may be resolution too. It's halfway cut off, but. I can honestly live with that. Now what I want to do is put this back the way I had it before. It went back to 192080p. But let's do something. Let's go back to YouTube. <sighs> let's see if um if I can fully open the screen. Okay, cool. So now I can open the screen without it going crazy so let's try that all right 1080p nope nope you see how it goes crazy so it's a resolution issue all right we're going to put everything 1680 1680 man that looks so horrible so everything's been adjusted to 1680. Let's do that. Just look at that. It's perfectly fine. It is perfectly fine. When I get, give it a high resolution, it, it goes crazy. Let's go back to... Let's do that. Let's go back to 1920-80p. Okay. Maximize. Nope, still, still there. Still there. Yep, artifact still there. This video is playing at 720. Now this is playing at 1080p. Alright, so let's do this. Let's set the video for 720. Alright, now let's do it again. So it's working fine from here. So now what we're gonna do is from Windows, we're gonna set everything to 19, no, 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 let's do 1680. Every, every monitor we're gonna set to 1680 by 1050, all right? So every monitor is going to be set that way, and then from the AMD software, I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, yeah, you guys can see it. See the black lines on the side? It's basically uh, the image is cut off. So to address that, we need to do full panel, and that's been addressed. All right, now here's the test full screen no artifacts no artifacts no artifacts so we're looking good we are looking good guys we are looking good okay cool cool 
So I'm back. Oh, you know what? What I should have done. Let's check the game settings to see what. So that's the render display. Okay, so it's at 19. What was the other one? 16. Oh, the app actually changed it. The app actually changed it to 1920 1080p. No, let's adjust that 1680. Let's adjust that to this. Let me see. 2406. Nah, we'll do this one. All right, so now it adjusted our resolution back. All right, now let's see how, see if this is any, no, nah, it doesn't look like any much difference. I don't see much difference. Okay, so now my monitor says it's at 1080, I mean 1680 by 1050. All right, so we're gonna rock out with this. We're gonna play with this. And let's see exactly if we get that same crash. go broke we are about to go broke broke let me see how much do I need for that, that other truck if the truck actually arrived. Now I'm in some serious debt. Yep, here's the truck. Oh, it's a two-door. Oh, that's whack. It's definitely a work truck. Ah, oh, did not mean to do that. What I'm gonna do is probably park this thing. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, yeah guys if you find that this video is helpful please like comment and subscribe to my channel um, if you find out that this video is not helpful to you guys please be sh sure to you know leave a description as to why it was helpful for you guys and what may have helped you guys you know if uh, you disagree with this video please you know by all means you know hit the dislike you know, any, anything that you guys do as far as like, dislike, comment, it, it, it all goes to a positive way for YouTube's analytical data, believe it or not. You know what I'm saying? So, yep, that's, that's, a, you know, that's, that's, a, little, that's a little secret, you know, uh, for everybody that wants to become a YouTuber. Uh, yes, indeed. If somebody hits the dislike button, it, it's a positive for the YouTube video. So, anyway, guys. On that note, have a good one. Peace.